Hey guys, we're here at our buddy's house uh, doing a special swap. This right here is a 1995 E320 wagon. And what we have here in the engine bay is an OM606 out of a 1999 E300. Right now, all the mechanical bits have been swapped over. Cooling system is hooked up. Forced induction is temporarily hooked up. Uh, fuse boxes are positioned temporarily, but right now, we're stuck in a non-starting situation. So we are able to get power to the glow plug relay. We can hear it click on and off. And we've tested voltage where the relays are powering up and the glow plugs are powering up, so it warms up. Uh, we have our K40 module that we tested here. We picked up another one to try out, but it uh, so far, it doesn't seem to be connecting all of it. We're able to hotwire the starter where it tries to start and we see the shutoff valve open, but it seems to cut off right, right after we try to start it. So right now we're trying to figure out if there's an immobilizer issue or some, something else that might have caused the, the, the motor not to start. Now this motor was pulled out of an accident car, uh, the 1999, and that accident car was uh, not running. So one of the things we're trying to research right now is if there's some cutoff fuse or relay that's preventing it from starting that might have been caused by the accident. So we're looking at all of those possibilities to see if there's something else that may or may not be uh, causing it to not work. try and give it a start. As you can see it cranks and cranks and the shutoff valve appears to click off for a moment but it sounds like it's clicking right back so it's, it's shutting off our fuel feed. And over here uh, we, do have, we do have diagnostics but all that it's showing is that uh, we have a fuel temperature error and a coolant temp error but not much else. So right now we're kind of uh, in a position of trying to research what might be cutting it off and if there's a, either a security issue, uh, authorization from the immobilizer system, or if there might be some other fuse that, that could be cutting it off. 